will face charges of mail fraud and making false statements to a federal law enforcement officer. She faces fines and up to 25 years in prison. The San Diego Superior Court has now ordered Ashford University to pay a fine of more than $22 million. A judge ruled Ashford broke the law by giving students false or misleading information to persuade them to enroll. The judge wrote the university misled students on the total cost of tuition, how long it would take to get their degrees, and how easily students could transfer their credits. Jennifer Esparza, she's a former Ashford student and the current legal affairs director for Veterans Education Success, now shares her experience. I was using tuition assistance at the time, and I thought that, you know, this isn't even worth uh, that money that is going to them. And I, I didn't want to spend the time doing it anymore because I just wasn't getting anything out of it. And I, I knew that it wasn't going to put me where I wanted to be after getting out of the military. Although Ashford has been fined, many students are still left with debt and they are currently searching for jobs. Letters are now going out to patients involved in last spring's cyber security breach at Scripps Health. In fact, I got one in the mail here. They say names, addresses, dates of birth.